What's up, everyone? Welcome to a new episode, First Timers. I got myself, Hero. Got Alvin. Got Alvin over You're here. Superstars of the show. Superstars of the show. I know you guys are like, who's the superstar here? What's going on? <laughs> I don't even know these people. <laughs> I know, we think of ourselves as superstars. But anyway, yeah. guys. So, what do we have to unbox here today? Um, so, we actually have a pair of shades, or window shades, for the charger here. Now, you're going to notice behind me that the charger does not have any um, tint. tint on it. Um, and the problem with me is if I'm going to tent something, I'm just going to do like full limo tent all the way around the car. So you can't even see inside the car. That, that's you know, super if I'm going to do it. Yeah, you know. So unfortunately in California, you can't tent your front windows that dark or your front windshield for that fact and matter of fact. Yeah, you can. You can. So um, people do, but you know. 35%. You 35% you can kind of push it, but not yeah. limo, not 5%. Yeah, but you know me, I want to be just like, I want to be able go to bigger, go. Yeah, you know, so <laughs> I figured why not um, use a pair of shades because I just, I don't want to tent it. I'll probably tent like my older charger. Even the El Camino will get like the, you know, like a limo tent on there. But for this guy, it's a driver. You know, I'm going to be driving, you know, I drive it at night. I drive it during different times and this will allow me to actually take the shades off so I can actually sit there and use them. And plus you take baby Alvin yeah, in your so, Yeah, so you can actually see him and all that good stuff. So anyway, let's uh, actually get it out of the box. So we'll snap our fingers. We're going to do the magic of YouTube here. And we'll unbox it here. Three, two, two. and go. Oh. Woo! Hey! All right, so that. magic of YouTube and it's already out. So um, as you can see, it is a product from a company called Dual Echo. Dual Echo? Uh, Dual Echo. Um, but then you can kind of see that their shades, um, it does have little hooks on the top, actually, if you're open showcase that there. Hooks. Um, so you can actually hook it right into the window, or you can actually hook it to the suction cups here, um, just in case your window is, I'd have to say it has more of like an angle to it, more like a sports car. Um, so we'll actually place them on the charger first, but we'll also kind of showcase how it, how it would look on Hero's uh, G35. Um, just because his windows aren't, you know, I'm not going to say as square, but they're not as square. Yeah. So you guys can kind of, you know, see how it looks. But again, comes with a nice case, comes with a whole bunch of these guys. I don't even know how many... Suction cups. Yeah, how many suction cups do we get? So there's another Didn't method of, uh, there's another method of uh, application. It's uh, Velcro. So you, there's a little sticky tape on the other end, and then you could use it like that. And uh, also to retract, there's a button here. You press, and it should just retract. Okay, so we got 18 suction cups, just so you guys know. <laughs> so retraction button. That's a lot of suction. Yeah, so 18 suction cups. Um, it looks like there'll be four for the potential top if you're gonna be using four, and then two for the bottoms to actually kind of hold on, or you can actually use the Velcro and um, kind of stick this to the inside of your interior if you're gonna want it to hold down. So as you can kind of see here, um, on the top of my window, I do have a thicker window. Uh, these uh, windows are usually triple layer, um, just to uh, add a protection for breaking and all that good stuff. You're going to kind of notice that the clips can pretty much kind of go around it. Um, the only thing that I would probably worry about um, on this one, um, if I'm going to roll it all the way up in here, is uh, wind noise. That would probably be the only thing I would worry about, but let me see if I can roll it up first and we'll kind of see how it looks there with it rolled up into the window. I do have a little bit of a curve to my window there. You can kind of see that it kind of sticks out at the top. So I might, if I'm going to be using it here, I should probably move it forward. I'm not perfectly straight. But I could actually have, you know, kind of use like a little suction cup. I got to probably set it towards here and still had, uh, still have a window. Again, this, these are um, very big windows. So these are, I would say, almost better for back windows and stuff like that, or smaller cars even. But other than that, like I said, it actually doesn't look too bad um, overall. But uh, here, let's try it with the suction cups. Let's see how the suction cups look. This is here, you can kind of see 50-50 here. Um, this is my glass on, you know, obviously that's not being blocked. And then pretty much blocking the rest of the light there. So it actually does darken it in here quite a bit. Um, so it actually looks pretty good. You can kind of see I only have one little holder down below. And I have four up top here. So it actually looks pretty good. And that will actually block a lot of sunlight, um, which is actually very, 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 very cool. And it's a suction cup on there, so I can literally just disconnect it and roll it up here. So I'll just literally push the little side button and it goes all the way up. And you can see here again, 
roll back down and suction cup right on there. Now the one thing I do like about these suction cups is how big they are. So you can kind of notice that they do have a very good size to it. So you can just push it right on and it's locked right in and just pull it right off. And we're back to seeing Hero again. So you can kind of see Hero over there. Go back to the screen over here. And it looks amazing so far. So I'll show you guys how it looks on the back window. You can kind of see it here on the rear and the front there. Um, so this one, I kind of pushed a little forward um, just because I wanted to kind of showcase um, you know, how much is out. Um, so you kind of get a little bit of blockage from the top. Um, I didn't put the other suction cup on either uh, on the front you know, or the rear here um, just because I just kind of want to you know, showcase it first the way it is. Um, again, just like the front, if you're inside, it looks amazing. Um, it does darken it up quite a bit in here, um, but overall, you know, I like it. Um, I do wish they were probably a little longer. Um, overall, it would have been kind of cool to be able to have something a little longer, but um, you know, other than that, I mean, it would, you know, gives, you know, gives a lot of protection. This is, this is a very big footprint of being able to block out light here. So that's actually definitely amazing. So I like it so far. I'll probably be running it with the suction cups here just because I just don't want to mess up my, um, you know, my uh, actual seals just because of how thick my windows are. But um, overall, like I said, I like it. Let's go over to Hero's car and we'll showcase it on Hero's car here. This is what it looks like in the G. Coop. It, it does block the sun. You could see the sun is shining through right now, but um, kind of wish it was a little bit longer. I mean, not necessarily like be able to pull down further, but longer. If I just back out here, you can see Alvin doing his little dancing moves. Now it looks like he's doing some it's a Hadouken right there. <laughs> I thought he was doing some yoga. Ooh, woo. So, hopefully you guys like that. Um, you know, like I said, the only thing that we we're kind of wishing is, you know, being a little longer. Um, I'm pretty sure they sell longer ones, um, but as you can kind of see, um, lengthwise, it, well. yeah, with these, it's it, yeah, they're not bad. Um, I think it just will depend on your window. You know, if you have maybe like a truck. You know, you know, with the smaller doors on the rear. Or these RV, cover, yeah, RV RVs, doors, yeah. yeah. They're pretty rectangular. Yeah, so these would actually definitely work for that. So definitely look at the measurements when you're um, looking at these guys just so you can actually get the correct ones for your uh, for your vehicle or, you know, even, I guess, house windows too. You yeah, know, it'll wherever, work on yeah. too. Yeah. So wherever you want to kind of put them. Um, so yeah, anyway, like I said, it's amazing. We're super excited. Um, I get to actually put these on the rear window, help protect the lavin, yep. our win rear windows. Maybe I'll even maybe see if I can you know, put another one dead center on this one just so I can still see left and right and then he still gets protection. Yeah. Now, like I said, there's, there's a lot of different uses. Usages. Usages. Just depends, which, just, just depends <laughs> where the sun is at the yeah, time of driving. So, yeah. So, but anyway guys, like I said, I, I'm pretty excited and stoked about this. Um, you know, if you guys have any questions, comments, definitely, you know, list them down below. We'll definitely get back to you. If you guys want to take a look at this exact product, we'll have it in the in our description as well. Yep. Um, so just go ahead and go click on the link and you can definitely go check it out. Um, they're not that expensive as well, but anyway, guys, All right. don't forget, smash that like. Smash that like. And if you guys, again, have any questions, let us know. TikTok, Instagram, and everything are also in the description. Ooh. So, woo! Anyway, yeah. see you guys. Peace. Later. Later. Peace. Woo!